And hello YouTube, David here. Today I'm gonna test my steering wheel right there with Garis mod. So about this, those are my pedals which are right there. And the steering wheel connects with USB to my front panel of the case. And oh, I forgot to tell you my new case. Bam! He, he's got a new case. So now I've already set up this joystick for guys mod. Here, if I can show you, it's called. I don't know how to call it exactly, but a right there, joystick. It's a joystick tool for guys mod, and let's stick to G mode to see how this thing actually works. And again guys here I am gonna show you how to wire up this joystick tool. So about that I'll provide the link in the description where I get it. So here in those IDs you have to put proper names to know which input output is switch and don't co confuse them. So here I, I've got analog for my x axis 10 to negative 10 steering forward, which is not analog, it's only a pedal 0 to 1, which is my throttle for going forward, a negative 1. So, how to set up this? Here you can see the Joystick configuration button. You have to click that, and here goes a so nice window. You have to click on your joystick. For my case, it's Hammer Racing Wheel Thunder V5. You have to click the the, the proper output, then click that. Oops. Click axis click that click on the axis click this and here it's already been set so on 3 and 4 of my pedals so let's have a little fun and drifting time So, wiring of the joystick 10 to negative 10 are going to my to hydraulic steering, which is in a mode 3. Anything that I put on in here will multiply by that and goes into the hydraulics. And also, the thing you should consider is to put the constraint quite high. Because this will help your steering wheel follow the values in your car quite nice. And here I set the damping. Did my gas mod just crashed? Well, I guess not. So, anyways, constraint, dumping, and so on. With my middle mouse scroll, I'm controlling my throttle, which I multiply by the up, forward, and back pedals. 
I add those and multiply by the total. Then this goes directly into my engine. So let's drive with the steering wheel. Let me just set quite a bit drifty power. wheel gives you a little bit of control over your car. You can do stuff that you can do with keyboard. Like precise angling for your wheels. Like that. Drifty, drifty, drifty. But enough of this. It's precise now. guys I'm sure this tutorial will be helpful for some of you who don't know how to make your steering wheel works for guys mod have fun and see you next time